school. They're definitely brother and sister. And they don't seem to mind. So we set this feeder up for them. Um, this feeder is not set up for hunting. Uh, basically just to enjoy watching the deer come through the property. It's really odd because I'm standing right here. They can hear me, they can see me. I'm burning trash right now. And they don't seem to mind. They know where the good food's at, that's for sure. I'm not trying to spook them, but you know, I'm pretty sure if I picked up one of these, one of these bags of trash here, they would, uh, they would take off. So I'm gonna walk up to them a little bit. I mean, I'm moving around. I got trash burning right there. Now, I'm not screaming and hollering, but they're right in front of me. So I'm going to try to walk up on them. I hate to disturb their dinner, but it's getting dark and I got trash to burn. And oh, well, who knows? Maybe I can pet one of them. I doubt it, but we'll see. I can honestly say I've never been this close to a deer without being in full scent lock gear and 20 feet up in a tree or in a hunting blind. Gosh, now I really wonder how close I can really get to these guys. I was neighing at one of them on the road the other day. <clears throat> I've probably moved about five feet. I really don't know if they're blind or, or what. We got a stomp. Usually when they stomp their hooves like that, it means, yo, what's up? <laughs> nope. I know the light sucks, guys. I'm pretty sure they're done. <laughs> All right, back to burning trash. <laughs> 